the thing that is important to legislate is people who have been structurally bad faith actors, by which we mean the fossil fuel industry, who have continued to, since the 1960s, put false information out there, shifting the blame onto other people, muddying the water. Um, they are the people that platforms need to look at and say, right, you have historically done this over and over and over again. This isn't an accident. This is part of a strategy that you are doing to obfuscate meaningful action. And I think, you know, realistically, you are going to have... A N is going to be less than 100, probably, um, cases where you, you do make those targeted interventions. Because if you do increase N to 10 to the 5, 10 to the 6 interventions, you are going to be treading on people's ability to say what they want. Um, and yes, you could argue that the climate crisis is so serious that um, suspending a few liberties like that might be worth it. But I am reminded, I think it was Benjamin Franklin that said, society that's willing to give up a little liberty to gain a little security will deserve neither and lose both. So thank you, Civilization Four. Um, so uh, yeah, I, I think that it comes down to the, it's not even so much the content, but it's the context in which that misinformation is embedded. Uh, who is saying it? Why are they saying it? And again, that question of, of scale. 